Valley will welcome concert goers Friday night to see none other than the Eagles. Fox 40's Dennis Shanahan joining us now live from Lincoln to give us a look inside the $100 million venue tonight. Dennis. Oh, well, Nikki, Thunder Valley has spared no expense with this 4,500 seat venue. They have attracted acts for opening weekend that could fill out the Golden One Center. More about those acts in a moment. First, I want to give you a look at this place. I have walked around. I've sat in various seats, and really, there is no bad view of the stage from any seat in this venue. Speaking of that stage, the Eagles equipment has landed. That's the Eagles drum set right there on the stage, ready for opening night. The guitar picks are on the microphone stands. We are just hours away from the first event in this venue. When you walk in here, it feels massive yet intimate. Gabe Caton has good reason to smile when he talks about the venue at Thunder Valley. Acoustically and visually, it's just a beautiful property. Gabe is the Tribal Council Secretary of the United Auburn Indian Community, the owners of Thunder Valley. They built this $100 million venue to replace the outdoor concert stage. Well, we built it so there is no bad view. The 4,500 seat multi-level indoor setting will allow for more shows all year round in a comfortable, climate controlled environment. Sitting down here is going to be an amazing view just because you're so close. Friday night, legendary rock band The Eagles will take the stage to kick it all off. To see the Eagles drum set right there on the stage is an amazing feeling right now. Even the multi-level lobby was designed to make fans feel like they're inside a one-of-a-kind space. There are nearly two dozen places to buy beverages inside the venue, some of them very close to the seats. When you're watching the show, we actually have a bar on each side of the venue, so you can go to them and not skip a beat while you're watching the Eagles play. Already, some of the biggest names in music and comedy are on the 2023 calendar. It's so exciting to see everything polished and finished and ready to go for the show on Friday. All right, so the Eagles on Friday, Bruno Mars on Saturday, Santana on Sunday. That is a heck of an opening weekend. Now, all those shows are officially sold out, but you can still find plenty of tickets on the verified resale market if you just want to spend a little more for those tickets. Might be worth it. It's going to be a very exciting weekend here in Lincoln. Live at Thunder Valley at the venue, Dennis Shanahan, Fox 40 News. All right.